to survive. You did what you had to do. Steal or starve, kill or be killed. You helped your friends and hurt anyone who got in your way. Ben's Antoine provides the voice of Batiste in Overwatch, but it's quite possible you've heard and seen him before in one of his many other roles, but maybe you're not quite sure where. From movies like Death Race, Romeo Must Die and Get Rich or Die Trying, to his critically acclaimed performances in the English and French versions of 192, Benz is a phenomenal actor with over 100 credits to his name. So let's find out where you can find some of his other work. Today, Benz is a critically acclaimed actor, but he actually got his start in the entertainment business as part of a rap group. However, he eventually transitioned into becoming an actor and made his big screen debut as the Crab Man in Romeo Must Die. Hmm? Yo, yo, okay, I hear you. All right, I'll do it. What? I said I'll do it, man. Slow your roll. From there, he went on to star in Get Rich or Die Trying. That's your right? Yeah. Hold on a second. That's 500. Yeah. Check it out, man. You're gonna like it. All right. Where he get that fucking ride? What do you think? He's also played quite a few roles alongside Tyree Gibson, such as a police sergeant in Four Brothers and his navigator in Death Race. We're coming up in 50 yards. What happened? I don't know. Somebody must have grabbed it. What you mean somebody grabbed me? Look, man, I thought it was lit. What you mean you thought? Man, get the fuck out of my car. What? When I said get the fuck out of my car! He also appeared in Animal 2, where he played Captain Ellis. James Animal Allen. Welcome home. Been a long time. Not long enough. Benz is also multilingual, a talent that he put to work in the TV series 192, where he played Tyler Joseph in both the French and English versions of the show. If you want to make your complaint, go ahead. I'm gonna put you in lockup. Tell all the guards inside what you said about cops. You know what's gonna happen then, right? Yeah. Now the other option for you is to keep your mouth shut, go to the hospital, fix your little leg, and walk away, my friend. I don't need to go downtown. That's what I figured. We'll take him. Brox, hit the door. Ah! Let's go. He also played a senator in the TV series Taken. It's quite an accusation, Senator. I have a plane to catch. I'm off to Turkey to reassure our NATO friends that we're not the kind of country that does exactly what you guys are talking about. Excuse me. In Rogue, he played Ty. You handle your business. Let me handle mine. But hey, in the meantime, if I need a light bulb or some shit, then uh, I know exactly who to call. <laughs> he was also in a few episodes of Mary Kills People as Judge Lucas Grant. Gentlemen, my son had another year. He could have done a clinical trial. He could have done a million things. What he could not have done was give consent, which makes this murder. I assure you, sir, if Dr. Harris helps your son die, we will prove it. Good. In Rookie Blue, he played a priest. Let me do what I came here to do, and after that, you can read me my rights. I'm good with that. This isn't up to you. You don't get to decide that. You're not God. You're damn right. And I'm gonna deal with the good Lord when this is all over with. He was also a district attorney in the movie Baby for Sale. You see, Mr. Zabo never bothered to get consent from the real father. Instead, what he did is he falsified the consular birth certificate, showing Mr. Mahoney to be the father, but it wasn't the case. So in essence, Mr. Zabo was trafficking in stolen goods in excess of $175,000. You might also know him from Breakfast with Scott. I'll step outside. I need you to be here. Right after this call. That I really need you to take later. Unless, of course, you want to skip Reykjavik altogether and cover women's soccer till the end of time. As I mentioned earlier, he's multilingual and as such has had a number of performances for French Canadian TV shows. Eh, c'est pas grave, tu ça vaut la peine. Tu sais, ça m'a permis de voir la belle petite famille, ta femme, ton enfant. Hein? En plus, j'ai une note pour toi. Tu t'en sais. Lastly, if you're watching this a little bit in the future, you might be able to see him in season four of The Expanse. So, how many of these movies and TV shows did you recognize the voice of Batiste in? Let me know in the comments below. And which other video game characters do you want us to look at next? As always, this is James Fakas saying thanks for watching and enjoy the game.